Hi, this week's tip is about positive affirmations for caregivers. Hi, it's me, Linda Burhans, the gal who cares for the caregivers with love, laughter, and lessons learned. This week's tip is about positive affirmations, and believe me, I am a positive affirmation girl. I have signs all over my house just reminding me. But today I have my friend Catherine Morrow here. And she's going to talk about how positive affirmations can help you. Hi, I'm Catherine Morrow, and I'm back again with another tip. And as, an, as I um, mentioned in a previous video, I don't know if you'll see that, but I was using EFT for caregivers. Now I'd like to teach you something else. And it's so important with our thoughts that we think positive things, and it really helps if we can write them down. I keep my positive affirmations on my mirror. So first thing in the morning, I look at that and um, it starts my day in a beautiful, loving way for myself. Because as a caregiver, you know, you don't take time out to nurture yourself. So we have to find easy, quick ways because caregiving takes so much out of us. So we have to be kind and loving to ourselves. So if you can come up with some type of affirmation, a positive affirmation to help you be able to start your day. And I even post them on my refrigerator, uh, in my TV room. I have different affirmations for different parts of the day. And by my bedside at night that I say before I go to sleep along with my prayers, so if you can, you know, it keeps us focused because again, as a caregiver, we get so busy and we get so wound up in the drama of it that we have to keep ourselves centered. And the only way that we can do that is, is reminders. At least that's the way I feel like it's for me. So if you can write down an affirmation that makes you feel good and makes you feel happy and just gives you that extra oomph to, go on with the day of all those uh, daily uh, caregiving uh, events that you have to, uh, you know, address. So, so, so be positive and then also try and surround yourself with positive, like-minded people. Ask your loved ones to help you with these affirmations. So when they talk to you on the phone, they can reinforce um, something positive for you instead of talking about the negative uh, things that you know we all go through in our daily life so uh, a great hint is to put it in if you have a guest bathroom or even when you have a friend come over greet them and say let's read my affirmations together because that's really helpful too if we do it together I belong to a group for many years where we started out the group and saying numerous affirmations, probably 10, 15 minutes of just positive things. And each person would glow. So if you can get a friend to help with that, it will just reinforce it. So uh, that's our uh, tip for today. Keep yourself positive and centered and nurture yourself and love yourself. I love looking in the mirror and straight into your eyes and just saying, I love you. We can do this. So just remember you're never alone and keep staying positive and surround yourself with those that can help you stay positive as well. Thanks Catherine for being with us today. As always, you're right on spot. Tune in next week for another tip sponsored by Arden Courts where all they do is memory care. Subscribe to my YouTube channel and please share these videos so we can help a lot more people and have a delicious day.